Well, with work and family and everything else in between, getting in a workout can sometimes be difficult. In tonight's Fitness Friday segment, we show you some quick and easy ways to get your fitness fix on the go. And back with us today is Faith Dye, co-owner of Siren Fitness, and her business partner, Allison McWilliams, joins us today. Great to see you, ladies. You too. Now, Thanks for having us. You're welcome. Now, you know, you think about today's weather, and it should really be an incentive for people to get out and enjoy it and get some exercise in. But for a lot of people, they put a lot of plans into place, and then they don't have time, or you know, so they say. So how do we really fit in exercise? You know, I don't know anybody that's not crunched for time these days, but if you even give yourself a goal of 10 minutes, you can get in a lot in 10 minutes. You can even really? get in something in the time span of a television commercial. So there isn't any reason why you can't get a little bit in a little bit every day. And you can make some great gains. And it's called prioritizing, really, right? Exactly. You brought a resistance band that I noticed. So what are some exercises, some ways to really get this fitness on the go thing going? Well, they're really versatile. They're great on the go, and they're great if you're traveling. So you can bring them with you. You don't need a gym. You can do a lot in a short time. Mm -hmm. So, for instance, shoulders, upper body. Women are usually concerned about upper body, shoulders, sure. and biceps. So a great way to uh, just put it right under one foot. Yeah. Give yourself a nice shoulder lateral raise. Watch you out get so a lot I don't get done. clocked. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot going on in one exercise. You're working your shoulders, you're working the back, you're working your core because you're holding your, your abdominals in tight. Yeah. And while you're using your legs, you have a lunge going on. So you have a nice full body exercise in a very short time. And you don't have to do much to switch it up and give yourself a different exercise. Okay. So for instance, overhead press, shoulders again, legs again, core is holding in tight, you're getting a lot done. And you can be doing this, as you mentioned, while you're watching TV. Exactly. It looks really easy, yeah. Exactly. What about adding a little variety? A lunge, you, you had mentioned? You can add lower body, you can add lunges. Okay. If you keep moving and keep mixing it up, and you have a really um, a good pace, mm -hmm. it can be intense enough in a couple of minutes. So changing it up frequently, changing it from a shoulder uh, press to a bicep curl, keeping conscious of your core, keeping the belly button in tight, making the leg move at the same time. Yeah. There's a lot to do. And this you we're can, targeting biceps. Mm -hmm. you, can, you can change your variety and your intensity with the band. So if you want more resistance and more work, you can make the band shorter. Oh, that's a really good point. Women so it's in very easy instead of having a number of dumbbells that you're trying to work through. Absolutely. You can change the intensity in a matter of a second. And women in particular are strong in their biceps, you know, picking up the kids. Sure. So you can make this a little harder and make it challenging and see results. You know, and a lot of women, I think, are worried they're going to bulk up, so to speak. And this is probably a whole nother segment. But mm -hmm. since you brought it up, I mean, this, by adding a little intensity, you're not going to do that. No, women in general are conditioned to think they're going to bulk up with yeah. heavy resistance. And that's not the case. You have to be, you know, hormones come into play, training, eating, genetics. So we tell all of our female clients at the studio that you never have to worry about bulking up. And instead, you're just going to tone up, and it's exactly. going to look really good. So how many sets? I mean, this is fitness on the go. So what do you have to do to really get a benefit? If you give yourself a goal from 8 to 10 to 12 repetitions, three sets, maybe two, three times a week, you can make some good progress. That's it. That's all. Simple as that. Ladies, thank you so much. Appreciate it as always. We want to let you know, too, that if you would like more tips from the ladies, you can log on to our web channel, NBC15.com. We will post a link to their website right there. Just click on News Links. And stick around. We're going to have a final look at the fantastic forecast when we come back.